Okay, this one is now running. Okay. Yeah, something... Okay. Something broke OBS. Something literally broke OBS. Like the... Um, literally broke OBS. Like... I hate that about YouTube. I hate that so much. Now I basically lost half of my viewers, if not even more, which will never come back. It's a new stream. I, uh, this is one of the things I hate down to the core. And I couldn't cut the cutscene. Yeah, so we we choose Ravenclaw. Um, I am. Ooh. This is also unlisted. Give me a minute here. I have to. I have to do some stuff. Change some things. Vusa, mal Vusa. Yeah, I'm I'm pissed right now. Give me a whole minute. Yeah, if it ever happens, just go into my channel and put slash uh, live stream behind it. You will always get to the newest live stream no matter what, so you don't have to switch. Uh, it's actually a pretty, pretty good thing to do it. So if you ever have um, that issue, just go on the top of the screen. Like let me let me show you that super quickly. Right, you just go here. Actually, no. You know what? You just go here. Right, and you put my name there. Right, you have the chaos move thingy, and then you go slash live stream. And then it will show you immediately the newest live stream and stuff. Well, not live stream, just live. I'm an idiot. Just live. Not live stream. Just live. And then it goes to the... to the newest thingy right there. Just live. So, when you do that... You should be good. So, you never, you never have to look for the link. Just do the slash live and you're automatically going to the newest live stream. Yeah. Apparently the old live stream is still going on. What the hell is going on there? 
<sighs> this is the one thing I really hate about YouTube. And one of your live streams is like dying. You might lose a lot of viewers. And yeah, you cannot you cannot um Um, you can pause the cutscenes, so that's also pretty annoying. Uh... Alright, uh, give me just a second here, I have to set up everything. Just a second here. Sorry. Hey, Christopher, how are you doing? Yeah, it's, it's so unfortunate. I don't know what crashed my OBS. Like, it seems like there was a problem with the NVIDIA drivers. I hope this doesn't happen again. That would be a real shame. <laughs> because so far, the game has been running smooth as hell. And looks fantastic. So, it would be a real shame if that happens again. So, please, please, no more crashes. Thank you, Chutley Cannons and the Montrose Magpies. European Cup winners. It's kind of so funny that they are showing like all the Quidditch going on, but there is no Quidditch in the game because, you know, we didn't have the time for that. <laughs> the double listening on your landing page is normal. It's two separate categories showing the same live stream. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 it's not. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. That makes sense. Unfortunately, it was this... Um, yeah, my stream, like, kind of crashed. And I didn't realize it fast enough. And so YouTube created a new stream, and now part of my people are, I think, still sitting in the old stream because they're lurking. And so half of the viewership is still sitting in the old stream, and the other half is sitting in here. It's like kind of weird. I can only hope that at some point they see the chat that I told them, hey, new stream is up. Do they have Quish? Nice. Oh yeah, Ravenclaw is in the tower. That's just brilliant, Amit. Brilliant. Uh huh. I think you could. Ah. Let's look around a little bit. Students, I have an announcement to make. I've become the new evil supervillain, wizard slash trademark, and this will be my base of operation and you will all be my minions <laughs> okay go on with your day thank you yes wait is that the moon tap it tap it I will just look around a little bit hey Amit what's up why hello would you like to take a look? Uh, what are we spying on, Amit? But thank you, Christopher. Do appreciate Can't that. Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Uh -huh. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Never met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. Can't say I recommend it, frankly. What? It's nice to meet you, Amit. What? I Why do they know like about astronomy. this? Oh yes, so much to be learned from the stars. Also, Kitchen. there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. 
I hope astronomy is on my schedule. It sounds interesting. I have good news for you. You are most definitely taking astronomy. It is required for all fifth years. Mm. You will be enthralled with the tower. Plus, a quality telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. I am so I curious to figure out class, why. Yes. Oh, and speaking of class, we are fifth year. First one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. Like I think this will be one of the major plots reveals. Age. Thanks, Sakura. <laughs> Thanks. My point was more... Where have we been the first four years? Because normally when a wizard comes of age, right, that's the first thing they get. They get the mail. And they're like, hey, you know, wizard. Okay. Apple, that's good. Makes me look more evil. <laughs> this should be interesting. Oh, what is that? We cannot use that yet. Is that fast travel? What are you doing? Mr. Not looking like Harry Potter, but trying to look like what Harry Potter. Watch this. Uh, what is this? Ew. <laughs> That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. <laughs> Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. I'm Everett, by the way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. And you survived a rather harrowing trip here. How do they know about this? I thought this stayed between us and the teacher. I'm glad to be here. Ready for classes to start. Good. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Wait, did you say most professors are firm, but fair? Ha, <laughs> I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do yep. tend to push their limits. Most. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bomb back to me. <laughs> nice meeting you. You too, Everett. Okay. Ooh. Fifth year. I wonder where they're from. Can't imagine starting new school this. It looks really pretty. I man. It's a popcorn. No, that's I don't even know what that is. Who's that? She looks important. This is really cool. I like that. There's a lot to be seen here. They have really done like a phenomenal job with the details so far. Is there... Okay. Dear devs. Is there... Oh, there is. <gasps> There's RP Walk. There's RP Walk in this game. Yes. Another thing a lot of developers forget about, it's like you have those awesome looking canopy, uh, canopy right in front of you, right? Like this amazing world they just built and there's no RP walk. There's no slow walk. It's just sprinting, running. It's like, oh man, let me, let me take in the sights, man. I'm so glad that Hitman has that. Oh, okay. <laughs> Walking stairs is a bit weird. Wait, what? What's going on? <laughs> you don't really have control about your character when you are walking the stairs. It seems like the character is locking in depending on how you walk. Yeah, because I, I entered the stairs on a weird angle. My character did this weird walk against the wall walk. <laughs> That's odd. Oh, can we play this? Oh no, this looks. Seems like it plays itself. 
Now the statue is probably the founder of the Ravenclaw, can't remember her first name. Ghosts! Ghost! Who do you call? <laughs> it's a secret, so obviously everyone knows. Yes. Oh, this is the boys' dormitory, I assume. That's cozy. Can I sit? Aw, right oh, man! Alright, first of all, let's take an apple and be an asshole while talking to her with the apple. I want him to be in the perfect place. A place he'll be happy with. But I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones! I want him to thrive here. Golden gobstones. Well, <laughs> how about just expression. putting it I into a window? Disney seedling from home, and I so want him to feel cozy. Disney is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. <laughs> I've a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Is Disney used in Wiganwild potion? It is. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about Wiganwild Potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about <laughs> theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. Man, I cannot be evil yet. Professor Fig does know a great deal about um, different forms of magic. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wiganweld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. Uh... <laughs> Most students grow their own ingredients. Come on. We all grow our own ingredients, man. <laughs> Let's talk about you. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your Disney. Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. Oh, thank you. Hey there, new Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You had best not keep her waiting. Who is talking to us? What? I don't... Who, who said that? Damn. Oh, you poor thing. I want to be evil. It's my MO. I signed up for being evil here. Yo, give me give me the broom. Hey, give me, I'm pulling you the broom out of your hand. Give me, uh, uh. Okay. Apparently, um you cannot be that evil to attack your other uh folks. That's really unfortunate. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Hmm. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. <laughs> it's Especially just five years. As you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, you're always yes. visiting level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. A.K.A. we make sure that you win. Here you are. Ooh. That's a codex. And we have to find all the pages. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. Huh. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Oh, I will. Thank you, Professor, but... What do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing 
it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Hmm. Okay. This way. But what is this way? This is cool. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic oh. and educate yourself about wizarding law. Um. Hello, FPS going to shit. Okay, we might have to deactivate the ray tracing. <laughs> Maybe lowering a medium. Let's see if that helps. Because, whoa. Ooh. Yeah, this is what people meant, apparently, that... Yeah, this is... Whoa. Okay. Okay. Um... Um... Let's go to balanced. So we can do there. Yeah, people said that apparently the moment you leave, like, you, you go into the real world. Um... Things are apparently get hairy. Um, we might have to completely deactivate ray tracing. Let's see what happens here. Not just your game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. me too. Uh, that makes totally sense because I'm streaming over my GPU. And so if the GPU is like... Ooh. I certainly would have appreciated... Yeah, this is not... Okay, let's deactivate the ray tracing. <laughs> yes. Can I save? The field guide when I was oh, we can finally save. Okay, let's do a restart of the game. Yeah, a lot of people said the moment you were leaving the instanced world they created at the beginning, the game is apparently not doing so great performance-wise. But yeah, I'm also streaming over my, about, over my GPU and the GPU is getting hammered here. The GPU is getting completely hammered into the ground. So, let me see. I should also probably update my drivers, but then I have to restart, and I don't want to restart the stream again and all that. Okay. Deactivating ray tracing should, should do the trick. I hope. This is what you get from hoping that uh, <laughs> um, ray tracing will not have an impact on the game, which is already looking good. That's that's what you get. Only way around that is yeah, or I could stream on my CPU. If my GPU is getting hammered too much, I just stream through my CPU. Because it seems like my CPU is sitting around quite a bit and is not doing much in this game. So maybe I just have to swap to CPU streaming. I don't I don't like the two PC setup for streaming. I normally never have problems. Funny enough. I never I normally never have problems with games. Because GPU streaming is not taking too much of your CPU. This 
this way. I can't imagine starting a new school this late. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. This seems to work. Careful optimism. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Well, tough luck, lady. Bootstraps and all that. You know the drill. Why don't you cast Revelio on this bust and see what bye bye pretty shadows. <sighs> oh well. Revelio. Oh. Ravenclaw bust. Oh. Well, can I go back and do this to the statue? Okay. Few challenges are the only way to acquire experience points or XP. Wait, what? Really? This is your wizarding level XP you earn from challenges increases your level and power. So they really want you that you explore and read up on stuff. Yeah, field guy, exploration quests, combat. Okay. Uh, each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlock at each tier you complete, from appearances to critical upgrades. Rewards must be claimed from the challenge menu. Come back often and collect the reward if you have unlocked them. Okay. Um, so we can basically now. Oh, we cannot run. Keep your eyes Let's open follow her. for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle. Okay. Yeah, but it seems like that fixed the issue. Good old... Good old ray tracing. Oh well. Oh well. No time to waste. You've classes to attend. Oh hey girl. What's up? Wait, is that a double question mark? What the hell? What? Whoa. Unicorn? I, I think it's a day for the unicorn. Oh, wait. Oh, 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 this is a riddle. This is a riddle. Um, she can wait. She can wait. One spider question mark, 13 question mark, question mark, Hydra is 21. Uh. Revelia. Okay. Oh, there's the one. Oh, we have to follow her. Okay, we have to come back here later. Oh, I hate when the game is doing that. See, this is why I want to be evil. You have been practicing, <laughs> you have been practicing shooting me in the Good back time. and murdering me. <laughs> Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your ah. field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Okay, so this is fast traveling. Uh, I have heard, and we will try to do this, not to use fast traveling too often because apparently the surroundings really change especially they later on when you made decisions and all that and the story is progressing uh there is apparently a lot even inside the castle which is changing up quite a bit so i don't want to use this too often okay so those are all the flu flames yeah, we couldn't we couldn't uncover the one in the dormitory. Oh, well, that is nice of her. 
Okay, cool system. Should I go there? Probably a bad idea, isn't it? Let's do it. And here we are. Oh. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Well, depends. The you loading times could be a bit faster. The castle, quickly from Central Hall. And yes, this Always game is installed on my M2. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. Nice. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Thank you. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for oh, you. Oh, great! Class. You'll be up More to speed homework. in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more hmm. to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Yes. Speaking Speak of the of devil. devil. Professor Fig, your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. And lying. I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. Hmm. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very That's one well. way to put it. Enough chit chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank no. you. No. No. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. Let me just and play. Invaluable to me. As I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Oh, so you're yes, spying on me. me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get We call them the wizard terms dailies. Yes, that is a very special thing only wizards can do. And those dailies would change on a weekly schedule provided by the server eh, by magical owls i've got an old gaming machine so i play several of my games from geforce now yeah hey that's like i i know that some people are kind of apprehensive let's, let's put it that way uh, apprehensive when it comes to cloud gaming but I think it's a really, really, really good thing for people, right? It's like, it's a solution to a problem. Especially how crazy high uh, GPUs are still. Um, I will be honest, when my GPU broke and one of our community members, Fogbound Turtle, came through and offered me the 3080 with 12 gigabyte of RAM for definitely a lot less money than it usually costs and if if he wouldn't have done it when my when my car died um it would have been a thing i had to consider because if i wanted to continue to create further content um yeah because internet is not my problem Never was, never will. But yeah, like I heard that 
if if your options are limited, why not? I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Like I know that some people are like, oh, cloud gaming. And I'm like, yay, cloud gaming, another option to let people just game. Oh my god, we have to talk to him. Zoom. Hey, buddy. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? Masterfully. You did. I did my best. But I'm fairly certain she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. It's AKA well, lying to her. Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. Man, it may require a bit the animations in this game with your and the face rigging is really, really good. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster. I like to listen to be the conversations. Between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. Like the hand I movement you have as well. The benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Like normally, we, we guides, see this hand movement. And so that I may avoid another not so subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. It looks, it looks so wonky in most games, you know. Okay, uh, complete the main quest will further the story, unlock new features and grant XP. Uh, some quests are locked by spell or level requirements. In this case, you would need to be required a level. Oh, okay. Uh, track the quest. So we have two quests here, the charm class and defense against the art. Charm class? Oh my. Trying to be... Charming. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, oh, it learns you Liviosa. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional oh. craftsman and a good friend. Oh, this isn't I'm our own wand I yet. I thought we already had our wand. Rocket. Oh. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Okay, do a hundred percent playthrough of this game. Mo well, would have to become a retro streamer. I mean, you know, it could be worse. Some of the kids wear tat off. Yeah. Serenade me. I think something is clipping. I wonder what they're using here. It's, looks like a mirror effect. I think it's a mirror. Well, mirror. Let's look around first. Yes. Yes. Let's look around. You've got the loner. Eh. Eh. You know? Fitting. Oh. Wait, are we going the right way? Please don't tell me we go the right way. No, wait, I think we are going... 
Ah, we are back. Gotcha. Okay, so we need one spider question mark 13. So... Oh, that's the spider? That's not a spider. It is? No, it isn't. What? So... Okay, let me see. What is this one? Oh. <gasps> Lord! Oh yeah, we can finally take a look at our outfit. And we got the majestic school rope. It is superb. Ooh, look at that. Nido. Um, I don't think we have the uh, special rope yet. Appearances. Oh no, there it is. Can we use it? I don't think so yet. Um, yeah, I don't. I don't think we can use the skins yet, right? Oh, black leather gloves. Yeah, I wonder if uh, can we put like a skin on it? No. Uh, how does that work? That's odd. It definitely shows me that I have this, right? So... But maybe... Maybe we cannot unlock this yet. Maybe you, you have to stand in front of a mirror or something. I assume. Yeah. Oh well, we are coming back to it. No, no biggie. Um, okay, we have a question mark. There's a spider. Spider question mark one. So one spider question mark equals 13. Then we have 13 question mark Hydra. What? And then plus one. And now we have to do question mark. Hydra and 13 times? Am I missing something? So those are the two parts. There's such I want that loot. Something about legs or heads, maybe. Um, it's like I can't really log in stuff. Lumos. Hmm. One plus. Spider legs. Oh, you mean oh, oh, you think so? Something, but we don't really have anything with one leg. Uh, 
That doesn't really... Maybe the heads? But... No. I don't think so. The question mark... Like, keep in mind that the question mark is a real thing. We can roll here. Right? Like, we can... We can roll question marks. They do exist. They do exist. One head. And I only can roll, that's a weird one. Right? I cannot even I cannot even lock this in. Like it's not like that I can say, okay, what I just rolled, lock this in. So you can you can also only follow it in one direction. Something here maybe? No. Oh, wait. What is that? Oh. <laughs> Red leather. Nice. Um. Yeah, don't really. Oh man, I'm too dumb for this stuff like this. <sighs> See. It's a bit problematic because I'm playing a Ravenclaw, so I have to figure this out. Right? I cannot play a Ravenclaw not figuring this out. That's that's unacceptable. Hydra is five letters. 13 plus would give 18 and then... Yeah... Like in context here. I think it's a letter thing. So we have to find something which has 21 letters? How many heads does the Hydra have? By the way, I have three, six, nine. So nine is the highest. Nine! But. I don't even know the names here. Like, unfortunately, I don't know the names of all the creatures they're showcasing. I know the names of some of them, but... I mean, if it's really just... Like, here's the thing. If it's really just the name of the creature you're looking, then... They don't have to explain how to get to 21 or how to complain. Oh, you, you, th like, but, okay. So let's say a variable so that you have to get 21. Three plus 13 is 16. Let's say it's the heads. That's 16, right? So we need 8, 8 what? Eight a what? Like, let's say you have to count the extremities. Then we have 16, so we need... No, not 8. 7. What am I saying? What? No. 16. That's 5. Why am I an 8? Am I a dingus? We need something with 5. 
Maybe the lizard? Like, four legs. Oh no, there's the spider thingy, right? Um, the spider thingy would have five, right? Five legs. So, and thirteen. Okay, problem. Have they modeled the spider badly because it has only seven legs? Even then, Let's say it has eight legs, that's nine. So we need something with four legs, so maybe this. No. I don't even know what that is. I'm just brute forcing it right now. Ah, there we go. Okay, so was right. But why? That's an owl. How many legs do you have? <laughs> so that was right. The five legs on that thing and Whatever we needed to get 13. I have absolutely no clue. Well. That's my loot. Huh. So we need the owl thingy. I wonder if it changes per game. Or if it's always the same. If it's always the same. <coughs> Guide potential. Ooh, ambitious cloak. Ah, no ray tracing in the mirror. <laughs> okay. Ooh, epic! Okay, so the next big question I would have is... Oh, wow. Um... This is now level one. Would I have gotten a higher level if it would have come back at level two? So basically opening up those uh, those riddles right now is a bad idea because you don't have the level for it. Yeah, well, that's slick. Well, we didn't fully brute force it. <gasps> Well, it's a, what is it called? A Niffler. But it is a mole in the end. Da! Um, there was some parchment. Oh, we find something? Definitely finding something. Potions where? Secrets. So many secrets. Man, love the stairs. Bing. Oh boy, here we go again, chat. Oh, now we can show what we have learned. Now we can show what we have learned.
<laughs> so this plus nine that's 12 so we need seven we need a spider right wait this doesn't have a spider Uh oh. Uh oh. Is it really the the extremities they have? Because the Hydra has three heads. Or well kind of hydra and the other hydra <laughs> is nine heads so ha huh. but we have to do the question mark thing right we have to do the question mark thing so I mean, it kind of made sense on the uh, on the first riddle we had. You were not wrong. I just didn't thought it would be the owl. Yeah, maybe maybe we come back to this. Let's let's push the story a little bit. That we are also getting our wand and all that, and unlocking the outer areas. Let's come back to that. Like this is not going anywhere. And I also think that the equipment you find is bound to the... Oh, don't drop that. Oh, come on, you would have dropped that. Come on, man. Yeah, fast travel would be faster. Surprise. But eh? Eh? Yeah, maybe maybe they're giving us an explanation or something. I don't I'm in no rush. Oh speaking of level up Sir get again Nice Oh my god we are so close another area oh god yeah I'm in no rush like keep in mind folks this game will be around for at least a whole week Rebellion. I know I, I like to jump through games very quickly but this is a game which a there's no other games coming out so that's a thing and B um, I want to put some time in I would I would like to do a full playthrough. I know that's a tough one. But apparently the main story is not too crazy lengthwise. I wonder what animal I'd be There's if I was something an in there. I just What the shit? Hello. I don't believe we've met. Oh hello, I'm Lenora. Hi. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. <laughs> Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Ah. Huh. Perhaps I have a look. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. I can't believe we're helping a Hufflepuff. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. Evil playthroughs are the best. Let's go. Yes. Yes. Unfortunately, we didn't have a lot of chances here to become evil. 
you know. Lumos. Ah, well. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Um, I'm pretty sure that's definitely nearby. Why would anyone bother sending Is your character's name Ridley Tom? No, it's uh, Zudia Mole. Oh, there's another one, chat. <sighs> I'm still. Okay, this is 17, so that would be 14, so that would be 3. I'm. I'm still not. Ah, this is like. Head scratcher. Um, oh! This looks like the location from the painting. What could be so special about it? Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Yes, like a moth to the flame. I'm going Ravenclaw. I look. I don't know why people are telling me this. Like, I'm going Ravenclaw. Oh, I'm going Ravenclaw. Of course you are going Ravenclaw. It's the only house you can choose in this game. I don't know why people are making it look like you can choose other houses. I don't... I don't get it. There's only Ravenclaw in this game. <laughs> I knew there was a connection. There we go. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Oh, this would give us level two. Bam. Level two. Hufflepuff is the best. Um, could one of the mods please ban Pradamesh for having an opinion which is utterly wrong, but having an opinion nonetheless? Oh. Okay, how do I get the pages? Okay, not like that, apparently. Gregory the Smarmy. <laughs> Smarmy. Blimey, mate. Okay. So. <sighs> but how are you doing, Parrot? I see you have been very busy. On the tweet twat. But how have you been, man? I am. Hmm. So. This is nine plus five. Nine. That's fourteen. So we need something with three? Wait. Three, six, nine, ten. So we need the the weird looking thing. Wait a minute. Maybe it's just as easy as it looks. We just have to Oh, faster point. I uh, take that. Where's the other one? Oh, it's up there. So we need... Oh! Wait, we need... Oh! Wait. This thing is not there, so this is not number three. Maybe it's the number three on that thing. But you have only five. I don't know how to do this. 
this irks me. It really irks me that I don't have the context, but I'm trying to figure that out. So, that would still be three, right? So, let's do the number three. Augustus Hill just wants you to buy something, though. Uh, one, two, three. I want to see something. So you have only two. Which aren't used. One, two, three. When is this game set? 1884, something like that? Way, way before Harry Potter and all that. End of the age or in hundred, Victorian age. But what would this be? No, this one doesn't, it doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense because this one is 11. So, I don't, I don't think we're doing this right. Um, I mean, I don't try to understand what the number means. What does the number mean? Can't, because there's already 11. So then it would be the owl, because there are ten pictures. So if we are if we are going in a circle, right from the left to the right, then this would be this thing. This thing. Nah. Seven. So the spider. Yeah, but then the upper one is not right. Oh. I am. Um, Super duper confused by this. I think that... Man, the moment I figure that out... I can make a YouTube video about this. <laughs> like, I can literally make a YouTube video about that to explain that to people. I... Pratamesh, I have no clue what you were talking about. Especially because the castle doesn't really change to the modern times. Like, the castle always looks like, no matter if it is Victorian age or modern age. I don't think it's anything special in your family. Mm. What is it I am missing here? Also... How can I open this? Yeah, I'm... Rude. Can I go outside? No, I can't go outside yet. Yeah, I don't know what the significance is.
I don't know what the significance is. Figuring out the significance, I assume strongly that that will just explain everything. Oh, you mean what? So, that thing, then Hydra, then the next thing which is coming up. But what is the 11 then? What is the 11 standing for then? In the topper picture. Like the lower picture seems to be... I don't know. Like... The Hydra? So would be the Hydra. The second door we just figured out. I. I should have made a screenshot from this. So, was the Hydra and the Spider. We didn't brute force it. This was not a brute force. The, the other one was also the brute force. We got one right. And the second one was kind of also like a guess. I. Mm. Oh. Yeah. Oh gosh. Uh, we should not do those riddles yet. We should not do those riddles yet. Because they're giving you level appropriate gear. So the higher you get, the better the gear you find. So doing the riddles now. Yeah, this is the cloak we got from... From the previous one. Also, what the hell is that in the background there? What the hell? <laughs> um, this is what we got from the previous one. Right, it's level 1. Because we were level 1 when we found this. And this is level 2 when we found it. So... Oh, it's the book. The book is in the background. So we shouldn't do this yet. Okay, but why spider... Can somebody... Quickly go back... Like, a, like half a minute before I open the door or something like that? Take a screenshot. And post it in the Discord, please. Of the door. I would super appreciate that. Because unfortunately we don't see this anymore. I mean we can... What we can do... We can really try to figure out... The top one, right? Um, is it that? No. Uh, what was it? Was there even a fast travel point? I don't think we had a fast travel. Do you happen to have any because I think we are really, really close on figuring out how to solve this. Like, now that we have done it a second time, I feel very strongly we are pretty close to figure that out. What are you up to now? Well, unfortunately... Oh. What the hell? Interesting. Um, when you join Quidditch team, unfortunately, you cannot do that in this game. 
I remove that feature from the game. Where was it? It was there, right? Um, no. Where the heck was I? Oh god, I already got lost. Potion classroom, divination classroom. I think it was Ravenclaw Tower, right? Thank you, Sekra. Um, thank you. I do appreciate that. So, we have the spider on this one. Right, and we had the Hydra on this one, because that makes sense. This is 9, this is 5, 14, plus the heads of the Hydra is 3, bam, 17, done, right? Then we have 11, plus this, and then we had the Spider. Which is eight legs or nine legs. It's just tough to see. Like it's three, six, seven. I don't know why this is counting as. This is kind of weird. If it is nine and the spider has nine legs, then it would check out. Oh, maybe it's the eyes? They're weird. I don't know how the seven is fitting in here, or the nine. Because that thing counts as one, I would say. And then the spider goes in here as nine, bam, 21. But... <sighs> maybe that's wrong. Oh, I know, I know, um, I know there's this weird thingy here. It's okay. Yeah, weird. Now, let's see if we can get to the other riddle. Let's go to the other riddle. I know it's a waste of an item again. Nope, that's down. We have to go up. I really want to figure that out because... There's some guide potential right there. <laughs> and yeah, yeah, I'm sure somebody probably already figured that out or made a guide on it. But hey, I like to figure those things out myself. So, Revelio. we have this thing, right? So, 15 plus 1, that's 16. So we need... What? Also, why is the height? Oh. I don't. So there's the Hydra again, and the other Hydra, and that's 19. Wait, didn't we just had 19? Didn't we just had the same thing down below? Yeah, we did. Yeah, we no. Oh no, it's, it, it isn't. This is 19, not 17. So we need... 9, 12, so we need 7. So what is 7? The normal spider? Is it even in here? No. Yeah, yeah, the, I have the screenshot in my in my Discord. So it was 17. Yeah, I see that. Uh, but that doesn't make sense. The Hydra has nine heads. The other Hydra... Why do we have three Hydras, by the way? Um, 
is 3, so that's 12, so we need 7 to reach the 19. The only thing which has 7 legs, technically, is the spider on the picture. And that thing has 5. <sighs> oh, it's a basilisk. Oh, this is... I mean, looks like a hydra again, but eh, whatever. Um, so this one is 1 plus 15, that's 16. So we need... 7... So the spider or not? This cannot be right. No. Maybe this thing? I don't know. <sighs> I thought we had it. I mean, Hydra? That's nine. Yeah, nine hats. And that's nine hats? Maybe it's really just a number on the board. But then that doesn't make sense. So to get to the 19... We need 5, so the 5th on the board. Can't do, because we cannot choose the owl there. The owl is not in here. Some already made a cheat chat. Oh, I'm pretty sure somebody did. Oh, great. I'm the, <laughs> I'm the guide maker though, so I have to figure that out myself. The outer pictures did count it deed as numbers. Okay. So what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. But that doesn't always work. Or is it one, two, three, four? So there's always a jump in between. So this would be four. Right. And then that's 15. Oh, 15 plus two. That's 17. So we need... 8? So it would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. The out. Okay, so that was completely wrong. That was completely wrong what they did.
Why is it six? Because it's the third on the board, so one, two, three, eighteen. So six, so it would be one, two, three, four, five, six. But I cannot put the spider there. That's the problem. The spider... ...cannot be put there. What? 23 minus 70... What? Six should be the seventh picture. One, two, three, four, five, six. Why would it be the seventh picture? Oh, it's zero. Oh, okay. Yeah, then it makes more sense. Mm, okay, let me see if I get this right. Really? So that would be... 19 is the number, so what we have to find, don't tell me chat, I have to figure this out for a second. So, that is the ninth picture, plus the third picture, that is so dumb. So that's 12, so we need 7. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. That doesn't work. No. That doesn't work. <laughs> right, this is nine. Plus up there, that's the third picture. So that's 12. And I need seven to get the 19. So, zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh no, you're right. I did it, I did it wrong again. So this was right. The head was right. There we go. Wow. Okay. Okay, now that I yeah, the zero. Who is calculating the z Get out of here. Get out of here, please. Get 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 the hell out of here. Who is counting zeros? Ooh, look at that cozy thing. Unfortunately, it's shittier. Yeah, I don't... Okay, now that we... This makes things so much easier. That was my problem. Counting the zero. Okay. Wow. I, I... Yeah, for somebody... Like, look. I'm shit at math. I admit it. I'm derpity derp derp at math. Always have been. That's especially why I keep it to the standard. Which is like, no zeros. <laughs> oh, here's another one. Okay, I would do this just to make absolutely sure there are probably hundreds of those in the game. So, let me see if I get this right. So we need a six. So we have four. Two. Wait, what? Four plus two is six already, so we're just leaving it at that? We are not rolling? I assume this is one of the moments we're actually not rolling. So this is six, that means we need um, five. So the fifth one would be zero, one, two, three, four, 
five this thing right there right uh where's the question mark thing uh what are you kidding me wait what how do i get down there oh really Ah! Shut up. So this should work then, right? So this should be it. No. But... Oh, the zero. Shut up, Chad. <laughs> Shut up. Hey, glasses. Shut up, Chad. We just established that the zero is a thing and I already have ignored it. Okay, so... How can we make this invisible? Ah, uh, we really have to unlock that. Okay. We really have to unlock that we can actually make things invisible. <laughs> I don't want glasses, man. I'm already looking smart enough. No glasses for me. Okay, so we have learned that. Well, that's pretty awesome. You know, slowly, slowly getting used to how that works. Then I can make a video about it after we are done here with the stream. Haha! -ha! Uh, I will take a super quick bio break, folks, because I really have to pee. I am back in just a few minutes. I will run some ads in the meantime. Don't go anywhere. Watch the ads. Support the channel. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you enjoy the show. And I will be back in just like four to five minutes after the bio break. See you then!
Alrighty. Thank you so much for waiting. It took me a little bit longer. <laughs> Sorry for that. Um, I'm also still thinking about... Um, I'm slowly getting hungry to get something to eat, take another break, right, eating something, and then just continue with the stream. Uh, definitely, definitely thinking about that. Oh. Off on another adventure, are we? Yes, and I have a very... Oh, there's the, uh... Slytherin Nexus. It's right here. But you can't go there. <gasps> but there's loot! Why are they getting loot and I don't? What is that BS? Oh, there's the... Um, okay. What is that? That is the ho wait. Isn't that where we came from? Isn't that just where we came from? Yeah. So where are you? Huh? I won't spell how large it is. Oh, it is. It is large. That's what she said, by the way. Um, yeah. Oh, it's two. It's to the left, to the two. Okay. Um, let's see. That's that, isn't it? No, there is no... I like the music. Yeah, there was... Um, there was one of those... Braziers... Braziers? Braziers? I never know how to pronounce it. Right on the left, when you were coming from that direction. Oh. That's the body house for witches. So like... Maybe that's the picture. Oh, it could be this. Ah, there you go. There you go. Watch it. Must have been here somewhere. And... Pew. Nice. Nice. Really mastered that one, haven't you? Cool. Spooky. Ooh. Well, that is for story later. Level one lock? <gasps> There's lock breaking in there. Some good old lock picking right there. Can I, by the way, can I... Oh, I can fast travel whenever I want, right? Yeah. Okay. Let's do... What is the closest one? Uh, I think it's the main hall and then... Divination... Ocean classroom, central. Yeah, let's go there. Let's let's just follow the path. Let's do some of the main stories because we haven't done that for a while. I know there is so much to explore and so much to figure out. Um, really looking forward to that. But we have to push the main story a little bit. Just a just a tad, you know. Just just a smidge. <laughs> Just a tip. Also, what is dinging here? Oh, this one is dinging. I'd actually enjoy her, Professor Gollum. 
Wait. No. Hmm. Odd. Maybe it's a fast travel point. Who? The sh ghosts. Yeah, this is where we have to go. Um, I think there's an easier way to do this. Oh, wait, isn't this where we have been before? Rebellion. This is the Slytherin thing, right? Yeah, it is. Kelpie statue. Are you a mimic? Are you? Revelio. Lumos. Whatever you are, I don't have the power yet. Um, the box jumped for a second. So I'm assuming we need like um, the, the crushing ability or something. Yeah. So a mole, I think the yellow dots... I have played too much Elden Ring. I'm not following a minimap anymore. I don't even know what a minimap is. Oh. Show offs. Break a neck. A good DM doesn't make the chest a mimic, but rather makes the magic sword inside the chest a mimic. Wow! <laughs> I've even seen some people playing Darker and Darker because I'm still trying to figure out if I want to play the game. And there's so many mimics in that game. Whoa. Bravo. Bravo. Good job, folks. Kind of creepy. There's definitely some stuff going on here. Whoa. Man, with ray tracing, this should look freaking fantastic. Oh. Eyes looking at me. Stupefy, stupefy, stupefy. Oh my god, go stupid finally. Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. Nah. <laughs> It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be I asking yourself how want an old woman like hide me my glasses, please. took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. Yes, because I'm really smart. <laughs> Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now. Let's practice what we've just learned, starting well, with something small. 
<laughs> it's Liviosa. Not Livioso. Stop it, Ron. Na 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 na. It's Liviosa. <laughs> I love how everyone else is just standing around doing nothing while we put in the work. They even clip through some items. <laughs> that's that's where quality ends, folks. If you're not the main character in this game, you you are dispensable. Okay, girl on the left side. Um, the action is right here. I don't know where you're looking at, but you're clearly not looking what's going on. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. When we did that, Remember, behind us, you just hear dude opponent. scream. Ah, I As got it. Pruitt, so artfully helped me. So, now the basic cast. Well. We are so good. Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelists. I love how we are completely Sorry, looking out of place. Welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cost, and Protego. You may begin. We are so out of place, man. This should be easy. Good form. What are you doing up there? Nothing lucky about it. This can't be your first. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. I do enjoy a lively duel. Yeah, take that. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> Giggity. That wasn't a compliment, by the way. He he said something very I'll put sexist. You on the spot and you rose to the challenge. Points to Ravenclaw. Thank you, Professor Hickett. Glad to have the opportunity Year to practice. Year five, please. If what I've seen Year today five. is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. You know, I know this is Warner right. Brothers. That's enough spectacle Ooh. for one day. Class is dismissed. Somebody has a quest there, I think. You know, it's Warner Brothers and all, so why wouldn't they? It's their IP. Right? But... Just saying, all of this could have been done so far without... The Harry Potter license. Just saying. Revelio. So, so far. Like, yeah. <laughs> Just saying. Oh, there's a chest of. Above me? I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. Oh, I would crush her. And nice I still work. cannot be evil. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling. Also, is it just me or is the main character sometimes a bit by the way? Wouldn't expect a new student with the answers. So deft with a wand. Then again, 
Perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Uh... I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Huh, fair enough. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Oh my. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Yes, Excellent. foster my evilness and dark right energy. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether hmm. it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library. You just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. <laughs> Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your Giggity. performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. <laughs> Man. Until next time. I want to get rid of my glasses, man. Also, can I ask something? Oh, there we go. Just gonna say, why are we leaning forward like we have back issues at the age of 16? You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented blue powder. Like, just saying. Okay, um, go to the charm class. Let's do that. As I said, I want to I want to get in like some of the main quests because we have been avoiding them, like the plague. Hey, Kalos. Harry never broke the rules. That is such a lie. Alrighty. Also. This is way before Harry Potter. Ooh, Cerberus. God, I'm looking forward to Hades too. Harry was a special snowflake. Well, first of all, Harry Potter didn't exist yet. Might I remind you that this is playing way before Professor Ronan tends to go the loser. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Yeah, this is late 1800s. It's like 125 years or something like that. Something, something like that. Late Victorian age. Here, behind you, there is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. I love how she has like a <coughs> like an African accent. Shall we begin? <laughs> and our character Welcome certainly doesn't. Of now, even though we are crucial year uh, whatever. in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open. Here's a lively one. To page five one seven. But before we begin. Can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Giggity. Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the Whoops. summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing Obliviate on one another. <laughs> <laughs> I will murder him. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Really? Nobody? What type of class is this here? It seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Hmm. I, I love how our character looks so out of place, man. All right, let's do this. Nyong. Na 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 na. 
<laughs> Damn it, he got me. <laughs> I couldn't resist. <laughs> it was such an easy one that I couldn't resist. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I Failed at the finish the line. But remember, yeah. don't be pretentious. Nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day. A straight walk. That we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. He is a real lively one. Yeah, I really have to get the ability to hide some of my equipment and stuff. Uh, this is why we are doing the main quest right now, because I want to unlock that. I also want to get my own wand. <sighs> and yes, Gandalf is later. I've found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? Which doesn't exist in this game. So, Thank you for reminding us. What better than a bit of sport? To put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> Damn. If I'm ever moving, I'm calling this dude. So why don't we have our newest student start us off? Hmm? Yeah, yeah, let's put the new student on the spotlight. That's fair. Very simply, cast Akio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm. That's it! Don't, now, uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. Uh. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward you. Very good! Oh, that counts as 50, right? Excellent control there. I know. I <laughs> look. If somebody knows how to fondle the ball and Very good. to but argue the balls call. towards me, well, certainly, <laughs> it's no certainly me. Without some friendly competition, Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are okay. playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Watch this. Oh, come on, really? That is how it's done. Wow. She showed me. That's eh. Let us see this. Too fast. What? She's always scoring 50? What type of BS is that? Wow. That was too fast. Oh no. Wait. <laughs> what? That's hardly fair, isn't it? Ah, I wanted to kick her out. I wanted to kick her out. Oh well. Oh well. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? I messed up my first one, but I got the hang of it afterwards. Yeah. <laughs> oh. I think we are well past interesting at this point. <laughs> <laughs> I will murder you. We'll need it. This round settles it all. Watch this. Okay, she's screwed up there for the first time. Not there perfect.
too fast. I don't know. Manage that. Splendid. Have to let go early on. Oh, you. You don't dare. Wait, can I kick her off? I wonder if I can kick her off. Oh wow, so you would actually like... Okay, you can change the points if you hit her. Okay. I mean, I could read the court rules, but... That was bad. Yep. Well, and with that I lost. Well. Very good, both of you. I could well say done. something right now, but I won't. <laughs> well, lost against her. And I gave her points, so. Oh, that's unfortunate. Eh. Eh. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Well done back there. You took the loss in stride. Didn't want to go too easy on you. Yeah, piss off. Took weeks to become proficient with I don't want to talk to you. It took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Thank you, but I've been holding my own. I appreciate your confidence. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. Yeah, I, I, by the way, I let her win on purpose. Before you know. I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway <coughs> around the world at a new school in a new country. Sure, Uganda. Yeah. I, wait, Uagadu? Isn't it Uganda? What? Also, funny enough, this is where my girlfriend is from. Well, it's been nice talking and competing with you. And with you. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Him Small details. Time. This game is stalking you? Yes. Of course, <laughs> you can use Akio on humans. If you're so inclined. A word well, if you would. You'd be using it on clothing. You wanted to speak with me, Professor. You know it I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation. Uh. Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? Miss Onai is a talented witch. Take it in stride. One often gains the most from the battles one has lost. Of course, Professor. It was a challenging match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor. I should have known that this game no, doesn't have like a lot of a bit bad choices to make late. when they said the game is now, made for Professor teens. Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for I'm hoping you. in the main story you can make some. Like they said, you can actually make decisions and whatnot in the main story. So, they already said that's possible. Oh, level 3. Hello. How was your first day coming along? Hello, I don't talk to you. Oh. And then the oh, boy. The where were you? In the Goblin Rebellion of 1752! And by the end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes! I shall share Ooh. the voice. Pretty. Man, they really put like a lot of charm into this. Yeah, oh yeah, we are still in tutorial mode. Stop it, Peeves, you're um, in trouble. In trouble, you will be. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, they told us that we have to go to Hawksmead to get our own 
went, want, wonder, eh, you know. Um, no, like they, they told us, mm, I'm a zoomer, look at me zooming. Uh, they told us like we have to go there to get our wand, which we haven't yet. So. Do you mind where you're stepping? They'll only think it's me. Revelia. Whoa. Also, you. You. That's not the path we have to go. If you step in the wrong place and become engulfed in a stench. Stenchy. <laughs> Windows is updating. Rip. Good luck with that. There goes the FPS a little bit. Yeah, I'm trying to get as many of like XP as possible. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. What the hell? What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. What the hell? Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. Okay. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? No. Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a strela. I'm just lying to you, you all the time. to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. What, more work? I'm not sure I have time for extra assignments, Professor. You shall find the time. You'd be astonished to know just You would do those dailies. In fact, Professor Rowan And then when you were done with dailies, you do the weeklies. Assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here. This is one of one of the Weasley's ancestors. I assume so. And spellcrafts. Thank you, Professor. Probably the grand, and grand, Oliver grandmother or something. Connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Okay, let's do this. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like Hogsmeade. you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. <sighs> Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Uh, Sebastian, please. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a capable young wizard, and he knows the area. And well he is evil like me. Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. <laughs> Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. Those names. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. All right. Let's do that. Uh, first assignment, the summer question, which will complete, okay. Um, do we have anything on the main quest? No, right. Okay. Well, then let's do that. Yeah, we are not, we are not. Oh, kitty! Hi! Can you pet the cat? You can pet the cat. Ah, uh, there you are. This dude. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. 
Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that, the mending charm Reparo. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. I need that in life, by the way. That might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few By the way, he has snakes up here. That means he is evil. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Ropero in no time. Uh, okay. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Okay, so... What do we have to do? This is the right area. I wonder where the flying pages got it. There it is. Oh, this is how we can get the pages now. Oh. Revelio. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Well, now we got the. Uh, wait. Man, you have to be really close to those. A flying page must be around here somewhere. There we go. And nearly level up. Nearly, but not quite. I trust the preliminary tasks. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try, then, shall we? Remember sure. to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor now. Wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Here we go again. Remember. Oh. Wand is a conduit of your magic. Wow, that's rude. Who? I'm cruising along. Nice. Okay, that should be super helpful. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. <laughs> Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Repair it. Nicely done. That's cool. Like charm, doesn't it? <laughs> and that's some level up. Level four, 20 plus HP. Oh, so we can... Wait. Okay, let me try something. So, some of these probably breaking those sometimes. Oh. What? Okay. Well, that's the way to do it. It's obviously control... Yeah, yeah. I've, I've already noticed that quite a bit. That there is a lot of like it's not bad but it's playable with mouse and keyboard it's totally playable with mouse and keyboard so wait what oh it show it shows me which path to take oh I was like wait what Yeah, we have everything on Ultra in the game besides, um, like, ray tracing worked flawlessly in the first area of the game, but the moment we got into Hogwarts, um, no. No. Ray tracing says no at that point, unfortunately. What are you up to now? Oh. Well, fancy meeting you here. Yes. What a Hello, surprise. Sebastian. Ah, 
my new charge. Uh, it was also it was not just a reflection, it was also the shadows. And I'm to accompany um, for them. It was it was so really bad. Foray into the village. It is. Even I with DLSS on. Since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavor to be the very best of guides then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place, self-contained too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? Have you collected your rewards for hitting X amount of scrolls yet? No, I have not, because it's cosmetics, I think. And we cannot do cosmetics yet. I would love to get rid of my glasses. Why do I have a feeling that Quidditch will be the first big DLC for this game? Why do I have a feeling that we do that? Especially because the Quidditch field is already there and the flying is there. I just assume they needed more time. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Because it's obvious, yes it is. But yeah, um... If I'm going into... Um, where is it? Challenges? And I'm going into the pages. So we got that. Yeah. Those are all cosmetics. Those are all cosmetics. Ooh. Ooh. Unfortunately, we cannot, we cannot do cosmetics yet. I don't know how. Like, we can see them, but we cannot wear them. There's nothing... There's nothing here. And there is, like, nothing I can... Oh, wait, change appearance. <gasps> Finally! There it is. Yes. Yes, we are now evil. Um. Ooh. Decisions, decisions. <laughs> oh, who? Oh, that's the neck. Oh wait, we didn't have that. Okay, um, change appearance. Oh, look at that. And then... Yeah. That looks also really good, not gonna lie. I mean, we are doing an evil playthrough. But <sighs> the Ravenclaw one looks also really good. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. This is a tough decision, man. Uh, we are doing evil, so. Uh, can we also change the outfit here? Oh, yeah, we can. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, we don't have a headwear yet, so. I'm not sure if I will keep the mask. Uh, we will see about that. We do a mission with the mask, and if I feel like I don't like it. Yes. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Uh, yes, keep in mind nice that the cosmetics I'm here I'm are that uh, the dark arts cosmetics, given my and they are. Spend a lot of time in um, detention, just They're collector's edition. Well They're collector's edition items. Oh, no, collector's. Sorry. Digital deluxe edition. Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. Huh. Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley <laughs> came to retrieve me, and I was able Avelia. to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. Yeah. 
Yeah, those are collector's edition. So how did you manage to deluxe get edition items. Well, it's the same thing I with... Like, there are actually two more opinions. things. I talked about this in my video. Um, be allowed in the restricted section. And I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. <laughs> oh, just one moment. Oh. This is an excellent spot to gather lace wing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. <laughs> Trumpets? Literally. Um, yeah, if you were getting the digital deluxe edition, you were getting 72 hours of early access. This is why we are able to play right now and not have to wait till Friday, like the rest of the plebs. Uh, then you were getting the, Look, the ropes and all that. Well, for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? Uh, there's also a mount don't see that every day. you can get. Plus, and this is actually the biggest beef I have with it. He's already seen the hippogriffs. Um, Absolutely. There is the Dark Arts Arena, which is literally a gameplay element where you so are unlocking an arena forest. where you can fight other students. wizards. And you can it's also gain Precisely. materials and whatnot for crafting there. Too dangerous. And if you don't get the digital deluxe edition, you don't get that. You can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. You don't get that. And I am very much against that. Have you had much of a chance yep. to explore the castle? Removing gameplay from the game. Positively enormous. Like, there is some it PlayStation is exclusive quest. Five years and which is like, yeah, okay, whatever. Loads to see. Places to discover. This is the mount you can get from the oh, collector's edition as well. Share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. Totally a blab who could... Yeah, like, again, I am very much against pre-ordering. But I'm also a content creator, so I've always thought Festival's pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. Oh. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Yeah. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Eh. Yeah, for everyone who doesn't know the uh, Harry Potter story behind this, basically, if you can see them the the thingies. I always forget, like, their, their name. Um, which is, like, moving the objects. Um, that means you had a close-to-death experience. And that's the only way how you can see them. Mr. Moon! He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Somebody is drunk. Right, sir. Oh, look right at me. Eyes oh, big as saucers. What did, Mr. Moon? Mm. Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. No, oh, goody. A Demi guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, and he's obviously had too much of it. Yeah, it looks very, very state. beautiful. It's a very pretty game. And it actually seems to have some really fun gameplay so far. So, already better than Forspoken. <gasps> it's worse. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say Yes, give me oh, the moonstone. Is sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, the word design and stuff, like Forspoken. Man, Forspoken was a tech demo which should have never become a game. This is cool. Oh, don't mind my death mask I'm wearing here Honestly, with skulls everywhere. The magic of this place. I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. Yes. Yeah, don't don't mind me looking like the next psychopath killer. So how would you like to do this? 
Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, <laughs> some spellcrafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with the new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. <laughs> just in a white scarf club. It's Hogsmeade. Uh, Hogsmeade is room to different side shops and other points of interest that you can navigate. Okay. Nice. So, oh, there's the world map. Oh, we cannot go to the world map yet. Okay, this is Oliviander's. That's the first thing we're doing. Oh, look at that! The hairdressing saloon. So you can change your hairdress if you don't like it. Wizard wear. Oh, we have to go there. Brawl and pack. The magic knee. Fresh produced seeds and fertilizer. An apothecary that carries a wide selection of potions. A specialty bookshop. Okay. What is this? Hawk's head. Oh, it's a pub. Oh, yeah, this is the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the weird pub. The, uh. The sketchy one. <laughs> Alright, let's get our wand first, which we should already have. This should be a very short one. Beard, not again. Yeah. I'll be right with Ah, it's you. Um just a moment, please. Uh, mm. Hello, sir. I'm looking for For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, I... about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivander's, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you. They're basically Truly. a monopoly. Now, come with me. They're asking Let's crazy prices. The one, shall we? This, this is what you get when you have a monopoly in the world. No, no, not you. Thank one family to rule all the ones. Yeah, that is going well. Yes. Hmm. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches. Hmm. You might do. That's also the length of my Give this one other wand. Wait, what? <laughs> well, go ahead. Swish. Hmm. How odd. Uh, once more, come on. Really swish it. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um. Okay. We'll find you something not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. That's a big one. Let's give this one a try. This is actually the real... S oh, okay. Let's not do that anymore. Oh, 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 oh goodness. Oh, looks Let's... Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Not the one. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. Yeah, I need 16 oh, inches. I think 16 um, inches is the longest they have. Where are you? No, it's Perhaps not. Perhaps you? Uh, ah... There you are. Yes. I think you might be the one. I don't even know what specs mine had. Here. Take it. Stalk honey brown, maple, dragon heart string, unyielding, 12 inches. Oh, it was 12 inches. I think you can... So this is okay. Let's ha let's have a look. Yeah, you can like. Curious indeed. Spark ash brown. Can make a black. Soft spiral. How intriguing. Natural gray. 
recruit Spyro. So you could change this if you want to. Curious indeed. You could change this if you want to, and then you can like, yeah, you can. Oh my, let's make it fourteen and a half inches. So you you could change this unyielding, unbending, rigid, stiff, reasonable supply, quite bendy. Curious indeed. Yeah. So I have already done all of this, right? Silver lime. Neat. How intriguing. Nah. Um Curious indeed. I like the darker one. Yeah, we leave it as it is. <laughs> no, twelve inches standard. This is like the standard thing, right? I like the ebony though. I wonder if that does anything. I think it changes the colorization a bit? No. And this is the... Yeah, we have the Dragon Heart string. Yep. So we already did all of this um, on the website. Mm -hmm. So we can already do this on the website, so this is why it was already chosen. But... It's great to see that they are doing the same thing with the wizard hat, or with the with the uh, chosen ceremony where you choose your house, your sorting, the sorting hat. Um, that even though we already choose it through the website, we could still say no. We want something else. So that's pretty neat. Man, this looks. Yeah, we take it. What do you think? Yes, yes. So much darkness. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> and now you have to die because you know my secret. <laughs> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do huh? not be surprised at your new one's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Miss Rolivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. I need more wands. Yes. I definitely need more wands. What is with this one? Oh, come on. There are some secrets in your... Oh! Well, there is a chest here. Money! Does that sound wonderful? Get out of here, please. We're not dealing in shenanigans. So, the last thing I want to check out before we are going to the main thing is this. Yes. Nyong. Hello! Oh, look at that. Ooh. There's also something here. Oh, we can just drink the tea? Yeah! Yeah, just uh, drink a little bit of tea. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very extraordinary. Okay, just some money. A bit XP. More tea. Mm, delicious. We still know what to do with those guys. Repairer. 
Yeah. Yeah, we don't know what to do with those things. Yes. Every shop is coming with a complimentary tea as a Briton. Yeah, I can see that as a British person. Sir. Well, first of all. Oh, we cannot do that. Ooh, a hat! We don't, yeah, we don't have that yet. So, oh, look at my hat. My hat looks amazing. <laughs> okay, can we change the appearance? Oh, we can. Uh, we will see. I might remove that. Floaty. Yeah, that pigtail top. Uh, can I talk to you? Hey! <laughs> yeah, maybe you can't yet. That sucks. Aww. No stuff for me. Oh well. What the hell is going on there? Um, we have to go to. Who's this, by the way? Sporting needs. You're selling brooms. That's kind of cricket. Ow. Come down there. Oh, well. Oh, it's locked. Well, surprise, surprise. Oh, okay. Yeah, I... Thank you, Zoe. What do you need a broom for without Quidditch? Well, you can still fly around with a mound. So, you know. Welcome to J. Pippin's Pushins. Hi, let me loot you first. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. He likes to say the P <laughs> word. On the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. Okay. And I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out. He's on doing it. this on purpose. But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? He, he is doing, like, all the P words on what purpose. What for you today? Um, Iduros. Develop consumer skin helping to perfect them from harm. Oh, we can just get both. Kitchen. Free to take a look at the rest of my inventory, or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Or, or you are not trying to fleece me for all my money, bastard. So. Unbelievable. 
absolutely unbelievable. I'm getting fleeced here. And XP. That's actually, I have to say, the way how they... Man, that's pretty. Um, the way how they do the XP acquisition is actually pretty cool. I like what they're doing with it. Well, you know? Pardon me, sir. I'm it rewards the exploration. Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Right. Can't very well be in the thick I thought J.K. Rowling was bad with the names in her books. I suppose not. But apparently in the writers see, of this game are just continuing that. Everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Yes. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Wow. I'm a student. I'm sorry. I'm not Harry Potter. I'm not the entitled rich boy. Okay. It's just flinging around the money as if it is nothing. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented blue powder. Not enough reflection on the Like, oh. I'm really curious about the lock picking here in this game. Did I just run through the NPCs? Looks like it. An inquiry. That's convenient. Also, there's tons of loot here on the other side. Level up. So there's some loot here. Oh. <laughs> Sleek sorcerer. Eh? Okay, seems to be like all in the building. Mm -hmm. Okay, how do I? Oh, this is now gone. How interesting. Such a cool fact. I don't mind seeing that again. Bavilio. Hmm. Wow, oh, there's so much here. Oh! Get over here! Ooh. New rope? But. Ah, well, will you look at that? <laughs> Maybe you need... No, I just need to go around. Just around. <laughs> Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcraft Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. 
Of course, it is not without complexity. But that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. I have to say, I shall let Professor sometimes the... For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A the conversations are a bit... And a potion station. Yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. And smoke your own weed. Let's look at what we have, shall we? If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Well, that's everything. Better go and find Sebastian. Also selling some pot on the way out because holy shit, I need some money. Like I have to I have to find like a like a way to make money here, man. Oh, those are logs. Yeah, I mean, we have to go to Grindelwald's again. Or Bingle and Blatch. And just steal some money from them, I assume. Look, right here. Bam, five gold. I'm rich now. Yeah. I'm super rich now. Wait, can I... Can I go shopping? Or do I have to talk to Sebastian first? Ooh. Needle. Um. That was going in here, right? Well, the good news is that Sebastian is right here. Hey, buddy. What's I up? I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. Also, that clipping. What? Troll in the... Well... In the circle. Damn. Draw it away from the building. Away from the village. That is some heavily armored troll. Well, there goes the neighborhood. Hey look, the game has even more destruction than Battlefield 2042. I would say we're doing pretty well. Oh, it's the... A taste of his own medicine. Nicely done. More like, it's not Z, it's Y. Wow, okay, I was in the middle of a spell here when he decided to do that. You know. Ah, 
I don't think that does anything. Oh man, especially the Y button is not really great. Yes. Finish him. Uh, well. And the troll goes Goodness. poof. A second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll? By yourselves. I suppose so. You should probably ask what we did there. Bear, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are. And we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. Bazinga. Again. Oh, yeah, sure. Let the students clean up the mess here. Um, I'm actually liking Hawksmeat oh, like this. A, a moment, if you would. I'll go and see what he wants. Like, I. It's an evil playthrough, so. Okay. I like destruction. Look! This game has more moving parts than all the battlefield combined. Man, as a as a battlefield player, I'm seeing this, and I'm like, and we can't even have destructible environment anymore. That's kind of sad, not gonna lie. Like, <sighs> Lucky they didn't do maybe the next battlefield will be better. Again, after I thought this battlefield would be better. Oh well. No rest for the wicked, I guess. Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Well, I hope you're selling me something Hello, good then. Sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should hmm. like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was right on, then. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. Tea? I own Gladrags wizard wear, and among my inventory are some Glad rags. that afford certain <laughs> protections, as it were, life-saving protections. And oh, you're with the mod then. Be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Hmm. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. My but evil answer would have been, yes, I deserve uh, this. Now, now let's try this on for size, shall we? But you can't be your perusal today. Take your time. Whoa. I should, like, murder him here on the spot, shouldn't I? You're giving me a level 1 rope? A level 1 green rope? Dude. You have legendaries. You have freaking legendaries in here. And you can't even give me one of those? No, you're giving me a green rope? Damage. How much does a legendary... Oh, this is the game explaining to us. Yeah. 
Okay, getcha. This is this is the game, like this is the tutorial. Okay, because the game assumes that we like didn't didn't have done that yet, because you know we have never ever. Oh look at that! We got a legendary. Well, good for him. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. Ah, three rooms doesn't keep my my changes to the character. I sell even more battle-worthy items. Yeah, of course you do. Shut up. <laughs> Greedy bastard. Should you be inclined? Um, this is the best rope they had, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, but I did saw some... Yeah. Yeah. I look quite British, all right? I haven't really found anything better yet. Nope. Oh. Uh, okay. Scottish. <laughs> okay, I have to. I, I'm sorry. I have to. I have to admit, though, changing this every time. I'm not evil yet. Let's go with this. Like, changing this every time I'm getting new equipment. I'm not sure if I want that. I'm not evil yet. So let's take that away for a second. Yeah, that's fine for now. Let's go with this. We're not evil yet. My shop at your leisure. Thank you. So, how much do you take? Plenty for your perusal today. Take for your legendary. Time. Oh. Why the heck are legendaries cheaper than all the other things we've seen in the game? What the heck is that? That's odd. Also, it seems you didn't equip your new wand. Nope. Pretty sure that's the standard I have. Choose a look for your wand. Nope. You're wrong. Well, not really wrong, but I don't have anything there. Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there. We might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. I love this cloak. This is also why I choose Ravenclaw, not gonna lie. What? There's a dude walking there and you were like, let's follow him. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Let's go. Oh, come on. You have seen them. Yeah, like what? Did they see us? Of did course they, they did. What no, they did. Doing with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Well, it's a treat to see you, Lord Gog. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. 
It's my first time here. Why am I so friendly to everyone? Heard about the attack. Me too. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm Thank you for this. My pleasure. Murdered him. I will say... Trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <coughs> Those guys. What's oh, time, Lane? Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. Yeah. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Well. I said, my friend is busy. Everyone draws a weapon here. I think you'll have enough bloodshed for one day. Grandma has a gun. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Mm. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Uh. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Well, trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. They definitely behave like ones. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. And on that oh. note, I think we should head back to the castle. Really? Like, after a minute, minute they left. We should also leave. And level up. Yeah, I really enjoy the leveling in this game. I really do. I think... They're doing some... Really good job. Whoa. Okay, this was not just five minutes. Ooh. Man, if we would have ray tracing active, I think my PC would get murdered right now. I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated. I can see that. I hate her already. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights, but we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. Hmm. Uh, you must return to your common room for the night. Access the map. Okay, the game is forcing us to leave. Because we are still in the tutorial area. Yoink. Fast travel. Which could be a little bit faster. I mean, it's not too bad, but, you know. Bird. Is that my owl? Where's my pad? Why do I not have a pad? Revelio. Bullshit. Read a mail. You got a mail. Oh. Come and see me. I discovered something in the locket we found at the Green Goods. Okay. Good morning! Oh. Nobody here. How boring. I don't think the map is made yet. I don't think so, no. I, I'm not sure. I I don't know. I'm pretty sure they mentioned that. When the map was made. Oh, you have to go up. Man, that must suck. Ooh. 
That must really suck. Like living downstairs. Man, that's a pretty bad. But I will be honest. This is like a tripping over hazard. Like the moment you start to run here, it's just whoa! And <laughs> you're a goner. Always check your toilets. Okay, so we have to go up. Yeah, we have to go up. And then we can... Also, can we reveal who this is? No, we can't. That kind of sucks. And then we have to go down again. Well, that's cool. Huh. Whoa. Ah, oh, that's bright. Oof. Well, good morning sunshine, I guess. do this more but I don't want to say revel you every every door oh handy yes. resource indeed your field guide I'm most pleased mm -hmm. wait what Oh, it actually sends us up on the right. Okay. I'm really thinking about deactivating the uh, the pathfinding. This seems to be a great game, which would have probably benefited from the whole idea of uh, the Elden Ring idea of just figure your shit out. Uh... That would have been great. What? Were we knocked out? Oh no, we waited for him. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, trolls? The trolls were wearing in the dungeon? Armor. It had that dark glow, like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I yes, I am very important. It's all about Rookwood. me. Because Ranrock I'm the main character. Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have, had Serona and the patrons at the Three Broomsticks not intervened. This is great news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Hmm. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Clever. Hogwarts, to be sure. But I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library, the restricted section to be precise, and a bit beyond. I How do you know that? You have never been there. The I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? 
I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit before we continue. But hmm. sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Yeah, so this is what we call a roadblock. And um, you have to progress further in the game to actually be able to progress the story further in the game. Revelia. Oh! Oh, wait a second. Is this... Yeah, it is. Oh. That looks cool, though. I take it. it. Doesn't do anything, it's really just for the look. It's just for the looks. So... <sighs> when do I get that? <laughs> I want my talents, man. Probably a level thing I have to unlock. Or oh, not a level thing, a story thing, where I finally get my talents, man. I want talents! Give me the talents. Maybe that is the talents quest. Um, but even if that is true... We have to save here. And then... We have to call it for now. Because I've been streaming for six hours straight. <laughs> I was so hungry and I love it it's great it's a good it's a good game great graphics and love everything so far about the game yeah I will be definitely continuing this tomorrow and we will do this after mole in the morning and your gaming news and then we're continuing from here uh, I have to do some work now I well, I have to cut the bullshit, which was this stream. Because thanks to YouTube and all that, uh, we have two YouTube streams now. I have to kind of make them watchable. Yay. Um, then I also want to do a quick guide on the puzzle. So I have to do that. And... Yeah, we will just continue here tomorrow. I will not play anything in the meantime. Uh, I might, maybe at some point uh, in a few days, I might just play a little bit of stream to do some of the side stuff if it gets too much. But from what I've heard, there is still like a lot of, um, like it's not too big. Yeah. And I see Dracodai is going after Vagabond here in my Discord in just a second. <laughs> because Vagabond is wrong. And Dracodai will go, actually, Vagabond. <laughs> but, folks, thank you so much for watching. I really, really do appreciate it. Um,. If you're seeing this on YouTube, do me a favor, uh, like the video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you want to see more. We will continue our hopefully evil playthrough, like we could be really evil uh, tomorrow. And if you want to go a step further in supporting the channel, we have also a membership option underneath the stream where you can actually subscribe to the channel. and. Uh, yeah, that membership is helping me directly to keep doing what I'm doing here on YouTube. And of course, if you just want to help me out without going with the membership, um, I went to stream here and then we'll just run some ads. So if you want to stick around to let them 
run in the background or whatever, that also supports me a great deal. With that said, I will be back tomorrow at 8 a.m. ET, that is 1 p.m. UK time and 2 p.m. Central European time here at, at Chaos Mall on YouTube. And with that said, stay safe and I see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Kaching! All right, folks, thank you again so much for watching. It was a pleasure streaming for you. We will be back tomorrow, of course, at 8 a.m. ET with more Hogwarts Legacy. And again, thank you so much for watching the ads. I hope I see you tomorrow. Stay safe. Have a good one. Bye-bye.